Hi everyone, the Spider-Man here. Well, I hope everybody's doing okay. So, as the title says, um, I am back on Instagram. Um, I want to apologise because I um, totally forgot that I actually have an Instagram account, <laughs> but I just never use it. So, as you know, I'm always on Facebook. So, if my amazing subscribers want to um, add me on Instagram, please do. I'll be uh, much appreciated. And for the last couple of months, um, a lot of my lovely subscribers have been asking me how is my Scolopendra Gianti Whitelegs getting on. And uh, yeah, it's doing perfectly fine. So uh, let's take the lid off the enclosure and uh, let's uh, take a look. And there we go, ladies and gentlemen. There is my only centipede in my collection. Um, I might get another centipede from the uh, Doncaster show this Sunday. I'll have a look, see what's available. I haven't uh, had another centipede for a while. And as you can see on the antenna, just on the right hand side there, it uh, looks a bit broke still. But that's from uh, when I uh, fed it one of them huge uh, cockroaches. I won't be doing that again. <laughs> so yeah, that's uh, just a little update on my centipede. So while I'm here everybody, I'm going to give it a Mario worm. Now I do know that Mario worms are not big prey for this centipede. But the only reason why I am doing it is because I want to take out the water dish and as you can see it's all full of substrate so I want to uh, take all the substrate out and uh, fill the water dish back up again so I'm going to give the um, centipede a morrow worm just to distract the centipede because I don't really want the uh, centipede to attack my hand while I'm taking out the water dish so let's get a morrow worm and uh, let's see if it's hungry so ladies and gentlemen I was just about to get a morrow worm and the centipede has decided to go under the cork bark, <laughs> which it never really does. It's always out in the open, so it's um, bloody typical. So what I'm going to do is, everybody, I'm just going to take this uh, piece of cork bark out using my tongs. And there is the centipede just there. Here goes, everyone. And like I said before, this is only a... A distraction method so I can actually uh, take out the uh, water dish so now the centipedes grabbed its small meal because that's the only food I have available until Sunday I'm gonna get some nice large wing locust so yeah while the centipede's eating its meal let's grab its water dish so let's put my hand in and grab the water dish and I'll uh, shake out all the Access substrate if it'll come out. There we go. Yep, there we go. Perfectly done. So, ladies and gentlemen, as you can see, I have cleaned out the water dish and taken all that substrate out. So, let's just top it up with water while the centipede's eating its meal and uh, distracted. There we go. That looks uh, perfectly fine. So, let's uh, take a close up of the centipede eating its meal. And there you go everybody, a close up of my only centipede in my collection, eating its uh, small meal, little Mario worm, or super worm. It's Mario, not Mario, because <laughs> people think I keep saying Mario, and it's not, it's Mario. <laughs> so yeah, it's uh, eating its very small meal, and I'll give it a nice, large locust on Sunday when I come back from the show so I hope you enjoyed this small update on my centipede and uh, please uh, follow me on Instagram I'll be much appreciated and uh, thanks for watching everyone